What's good my peeps? The Rock is back at you again with another action figure review. This time we have from G.I. Joe Classified Series the Target exclusive Python Patrol Cobra Viper. And uh, this is of course just a repaint of uh, the uh, Cobra Vipers that we've all come to know and love uh, slash hate for those of you that remember what went down with another Target exclusive, the Cobra Island version of the Cobra Viper. Uh, you remember that debacle from a couple years ago, but um, we're past that now. And uh, the wild thing is, this has been totally flipped. Uh, acquiring this guy or guys for me was uh, was uh, was easy. I mean, the hunt should be this easy. It was crazy. I saw that uh, particular. Target had four of them. I went down there and grabbed all four. Instant army build. There you go. So it was like that. So um, we're not going to get deep into this because we've been there, done that with the Cobra Viper, even on this channel. As uh, as late as the uh, Viper 3 pack with the officer and the two troops. So we've already, uh, we already know what time it is in terms of articulation, this, that, and the third. What we're going to do here, uh, essentially, is just uh, compare the uh, four different versions of the Cobra Viper. So uh, let's get this party started. Before we do that though, I'd be remiss to not show the side artwork because it is different. So there you go. There you go, Python Patrol Cobra Viper. And in case somebody wants to jump on me for not showing the back, here we go. This is uh, just a uh, some nice artwork, I will say that. Um, but um, yeah, there's nothing really uh, crazy going on. It almost looks as though uh, they're being surveilled by uh, someone. Would it be uh, would it be the Vipers surveying something, or is it GI Joe surveying the Vipers? So here we have our Python Patrol Cobra Viper target exclusive on our rotating base giving you a 360 degree view so you can see uh, the differences right off bat between this version of the Viper and the uh, previous iterations. And uh, while he's spinning round and round, I need you guys to go down below, like this video, and if you haven't done so already, subscribe to the channel and help us grow. And uh, while you guys are doing that, and while our Viper is getting dizzy, what I will be doing is going uh, over the accessories. We've seen them before, but uh, I'd be remiss to not show them again. He, of course, comes with the backpack, as they all do, and uh, we will get into any differences in colors, like the grenades on this one is yellow. Of course, the uh, Cobra Insignia is red, and the rope is a uh, like an off-grayish color, and the uh, backpack itself molded in a black. You see the peg right there? So, uh, yep, that's one. And what would a Viper be without his goggles? As you can see here, molded in black, and the lenses are colored in red. He also comes with the standard issue sidearm, molded in black, no paint apps whatsoever, as usual. And of course, he comes with his standard long-range weapon. All the Vipers come with uh, this particular uh, style rifle, and it also comes with a magazine which is removable and the wild thing about this go round this magazine was uh, in package already uh, removed and in its own little tray compartment uh, so uh, yeah they it's already been separated I guess maybe they figured that people kind of sort of didn't know that the magazines were removable before so I think that's a pretty good touch from Hasbro so now we've got our Python Patrol Cobra Viper fully equipped and I've got them this way because like I said, this is a comparison video. So what we're going to do is uh, show him with his counterparts. Here he is with the first Target exclusive, the Cobra Island Cobra Viper. And here he is with the Viper from the recently released three pack Amazon exclusive. Got nothing but exclusives here. And last but certainly not least, we have the Cobra Officer that was also part of the uh, Viper 3-pack. 
and uh, as you can see they're all different in terms of their paint apps and uh, we will uh, do some side by sides first thing we'll do is look at their backpacks see the differences in the coloration they're all the same backpack same mold uh, you see that the uh, officer the grenades are just the uh, flat gray whereas on the Cobra Island which we're going from our left to our right here the Cobra Island Viper the uh, grenades are red the the uh, our uh, Python Patrol Viper the grenades are yellow and of course the uh, the troop Viper that came in the three pack the grenades are a also gray but a darker gray than the uh, Cobra Viper officer as far as the Cobra insignias officer you see it's like a uh, a nice gold color the uh, the uh, the other three are different shades of red the Cobra Island version is a brighter more vibrant red than the uh, Python patrol Viper which is a more dull red but still that red is uh, brighter than the uh, three pack version which is a very dull almost uh, almost rustic type of red so those are the three differences just there on the backpack of course we're talking about the ropes too the rope on the officer is a uh, kind of like a grayish white whereas on the Cobra Island version it's straight up gray and uh, on our Python Patrol it's a uh, lighter shade of gray and on our Viper from the three pack it is an off white now looking at our Viper's head on we can see the difference it will start right from the top going to the bottom let's start with the goggles you see they're all all the goggles are molded in black but the officers lenses are a uh, almost a uh, gold kind of yellowish kind of lens whereas the original Cobra Island Viper the lenses are just straight up black and uh, on our uh, Python Patrol version the lenses are red and the Viper the troop we'll call it the troop Viper his lenses are silver so the differences between the uh, officer and the uh, the troop that came in the three pack one's lenses are gold the other silver insignia the officers uh, Cobra insignia gold whereas uh, it's being hidden by his bandana but uh, our Cobra Island Viper has got red insignia the uh, insignia on our uh, on our uh, Python Patrol is red but it's uh, it's, uh, it's against a uh, a very light gray background because of the different colors of the uh, Python Patrol's colors and uh, then of course once again the uh, bandana is covering up the insignia on our troop and it is that uh, rustic kind of brownish red is the insignia there and of course you see the differences in the color schemes of all four uh, vipers uh, the troopers are um, essentially blue even though the Cobra Island blue is more vibrant than the troop blue but they're still blue they got the uh, the black vests and of course all of the line work the grenades on the front on the uh, Cobra Island Viper red and uh, the troop is that rustic red the uh, officer is black as well as the Python patrols uh, grenades on the front are also black and you see the differences in the color the vest on the uh, officer is like a uh, rust color in fact that there it's very similar to uh, the troop that comes with him the troops the troopers that come with him the line work there is like the same kind of the same color might be a little bit different uh, just looks kind of different uh, because of the uh, one is gray and the other is blue so you have all that so you can see your differences right there the visors check out the visors I almost skipped that the officer's visor is gold and uh, we have uh, the Cobra Island version is silver as well as the uh, the troopers being silver and our Python patrol visor is uh, red so um, yeah those are the differences uh, 
you see that they're all sport different weapons don't worry about that they all come with that same basic weapon that our um, two uh, vipers uh, uh, exclusive target exclusive vipers come with they, they all come with uh, this basic kind of weapon so um, that's basic like I said that's their standard issue so there you have it with the uh, the uh, the Cobra Vipers it's crazy they're all exclusive so no general release for the Vipers we've got an Amazon exclusive right there Amazon exclusive right there Target exclusive the first one right there and of course Target exclusive right there so that is the Cobra Vipers these are the Cobra Vipers excuse me bad grammar there you see the differences once again unless you're a completionist like myself you know there are some that could be considered passes I don't think uh, the three packs of pass because it's great to have an officer with different deco to show uh, his distinction from the troops and then of course you've got the you know if there's going to be one that you can like live without more than likely it's the Python Patrol one because uh, you know that's just the repaint and let's keep it a buck it's kind of like money grab and just to um, just for Target to have its own exclusive but for me I think it's cool because even though the Vipers are like a specialized division uh, in the Cobra Infantry the Python Patrol could be an even more specialized you know total even I don't know how more, much more black you can get than black ops but that's what the Python Patrol could be with its colors so anyhow that's how you rationalize getting them all uh, so yeah that's that'll do it for this it was just a, a comparative review and we have done that please like share subscribe leave your comments below which one is your favorite which colors are your favorite do you like them all can you do without some or whatever let me know down there if you want to be notified when I upload another video hit that bell while you're down there subscribing and sharing and you will be notified the next time I do upload a video on behalf of all the Vipers Target Amazon Cobra this is the Ruckness Monster leaving you with this remember the hunt continues and I'm out peace